Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Anusha Nati and today I'm going to create this creative, crazy a festival look. It is really colorful, it has glitter, it's crazy. You can totally tone it down but you know, I wanted to do something different. If you want to know how to create this look, thank you for watching. So the first thing I'm going to do is uh, give some a highlight to my face and my body because I really want to glow for festivals of course. So for this I'm going to use the Strobe Pay Astro Cream from Primer. This is in the color Pearl. I find this is like almost a dupe for the MAC one. The only thing is this has more glitter in it and the MAC one is like less glitter. Glitter is more like a pretty sheen. But my highlight can be intense today, so. And also the MAC one is more hydrating. It's like really a cream. And this is more, yeah, how do I say that? More like a gel or something. Like it dries down pretty fast. And it's like a little tacky, but it's not really moisturizing or anything. And I find, I found that the MAC one is moisturizing. But you know, for the spice, like 3 euros or something. It's, it's not bad. So we're now going to move on to the face and the eyebrows. So first going to do... Uh, for my brows, I'm going to use my Anastasia Dip Brow Promade in the color Dark Brown. I'm going to set that in place with my Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. So for my eyeshadow base, I'm going to use the Revolution Conceal and Define in the color C12. And just go to apply it on my eyelids and like also going to carve out my eyebrows with it. And I'm just going to set that with a, a light shade because we're going to use... To do like a really colorful look so i really want my base to be light so the color will like really pop you can use any eyeshadow or setting so now we look like this crazy i'm going to zoom you in and now we're going to do the eyeshadow look and for this i'm going to use my morphe 25b palette and to prevent anything to fall down on my face because I just pry my face, I don't feel like do that again. I'm just going to put on some eyeshadow shoots. Okay, now we definitely look like really crazy. Sorry for my red eyes. I oh my, my eyes are so dry and I'm tired, but not going to do a campaign. We're going to get this look done. Okay. So the first shade I'm going to take from this palette is the yellow shade right here. And I'm focusing that into the crease and also above. So here I'm blending in it upwards. This will give a light radiance. I really want to use like a lot of crazy colors today. I am not sure what kind of look I'm going to do. I only know it's going to like be really, really colorful. I really want to play with colors. You know, I'm always doing like the same old, same look like everyone else is doing. And I just want to do something else for a change. So look at how pigmented that is. Okay. So with the same brush, I'm going to pick up that orange shade and that shade we're going to like really focus into the crease taking that orange shade again and just blending the edges here so, uh, there are no harsh lines just going to take like a small brush. I'm taking this red shade right here. And I'm going to focus on that on the outer corner. Oh, that is really big. So I'm now going to take the 35P palette. The shade right here. So I got this shade. <coughs> 
right here it was from a morphe palette i'm just going to take a small brush so i just want the eyeshadow a little more a little more dark blue so i'm going to take in this shade or from a sleek palette mermaid collection and just my modern modern renaissance palette i'm going to take cypress umber uh, you can to use any a uh, dark eyeshadow you have you just want to like darken up that outer corner of my crease like this here and just like really focusing it on here and I blend it in or with that red shadow just really intensify our shades again because of the blending everything just so that's now for the eyes we will finish that up later on let's go back to the face so I'm just going to do uh, some correcting around my mouth with the makeup studio concealer in the color orange what it looks like and just dabbing it around my mouth area i suggest to leave this like one or two minutes so it can dry down a little bit and then apply your foundation on for my foundation i'm going to use my la girl pro coverage in the color bronze i'm blending it out with my real technique sponge But before I go to do my concealer, I really want to do my eyeliner so I can clean up if I made a mistake. I'm going to use my Inglot eyeliner in the color 77. So now I go and apply my concealer and for this I'm going to use the Revolution one in the color C12 underneath my eyes. Like a little bit of highlighting. And I'm going to use the color C13 to, to like give some more coverage to my mount area. Just where I think that I need it. So before I'm going to set anything, I really want to add like a drop of a iconic, the iconic London Illuminator. Uh, this is the original color you know i really want like that really pop of highlighting so i already see i am highlighted but not enough um you know i find with a festival you can like go out go all out it's all or nothing for me okay um just going to take it out there take it out there and I'm blending it out with my finger so now I'm going to take a small brush and take my Laura Mercier translucent powder and go to set my face. So now I'm going to take my Kevin Aquan sculpting powder in the color D. Taking a, a really small brush and just contouring my face with this. You like don't need a lot. You really need a tiny, 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 tiny bit. This stuff. You can see it already, it's so intense. For bronzer, I'm going to take my NYX Matte Bronzer in the color Deep. I think we mean it's in the color Deep. I'm going to apply a little bit of a blush and. I'm going to take my Morphe 9N palette for this and go to take the darker shade right here and just mix it a little with the shade next to it because that one has like a beautiful um, sheen into it. So let's see. Now for highlighter, I'm going to take my Ju Way and just go to set that.
from the same 35 p palette i'm going to take that first shade right here and i'm going to highlight my inner corners with this shade applied some eyelashes off camera and i thought my camera was, film was filming but it wasn't so on my bottom uh, lash line i put the dark purple shade first and then blend out with the uh, red shade we used so uh, move on to the lips for the lips for the lips i'm going to use my milani amor So I do want to do like something crazy for this look. So I was thinking to do something with a glitter. I just I got the Beauty Glaze palette from AliExpress. And this is, this is the bomb. Like look at how gorgeous these colors look. So no, I got this one with the bronze shade. So I'm going to take this color right here. Just going to take this with my finger because you don't need any a glitter a glue. And I'm just going to apply it on the top of my lip right here. So this completes the finished looks guys. I really hope you enjoy this video. And so please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And I will see you in my next video. And same with me. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button. Bye bye.